Hello. Let's talk today about awe and wonder. There's this idea that Christmas should be magical. And what if we changed the perspective on that? And as we focus on the Christ child, also understand that awe and wonder come along with that story. As the shepherds leave seeing the uh, newborn baby, they tell everyone they meet about it and people wonder. And Mary ponders all of these things in her heart. Then if you fast forward to the end of Luke's gospel, we see again wonder. Peter wonders at the empty tomb. The women wonder at what they see. Awe and wonder. There's research that shows us um, when we experience awe and wonder, we're more generous, altruistic. There's more cooperation. And awe and wonder has the capacity to help us get through challenging and difficult times. And that research comes from a book that focuses on clergy well-being. How is awe and wonder for you? Sometimes we've got to go looking for it to find it. And here uh, is where I found some awe and wonder recently. So let me share my screen. And I hope this inspires you with a bit of awe and wonder also. So these are our goats. That's a quick little quip. They did that for they did that for minutes on end. And it was so fun to watch because they're just doing what they were created to do. I hope and pray you are filled with awe and wonder.